Well, today I'm out on what could be the last ride of the season. Just looking at the forecast, and it looks like the highs for next week are going to be in the 30s. So, uh, I'm not real sure how many more of these I can get in. I know the and the lows have been getting way down into the teens already, so it's hard to get a ride in. Sometimes I get one in after work, but uh, it's uh, it's getting tougher and tougher. It's getting a little colder out here. So in this video, I was just wondering what you guys do in the off season. I know some of you guys that live down south don't have this problem. So I know when I used to live in Nevada, you could uh, ride all year. You just uh, had to go out early in the morning or late in the evenings in the summer so you didn't roast. But up here it's a different story. Everything kind of uh, shuts down in the winter time. Roads get a little too nasty to take your bike out. So I was wondering what you guys do in the off season of the people that actually have an off season. What kind of hobbies do you have? What do you do to pass your time? I do a few things. Uh, Trout Unlimited will put on some presentations sometime and I'll go uh, watch those. The guys uh, talk about how they uh, go all over the world to fish. They show pictures and stuff like that. So that's kind of cool to do get you out of the house. Also uh, belong to a model railroad club which will get me out of the house one night a week. Go out there and work on the layout. It's kind of cool. You can uh, build buildings, uh, you know, do landscape mountains and stuff like that. Kind of keeps you busy. Doesn't cost a lot of money. Get you off the couch and out from in front of the TV. Get you moving a little bit anyway. Another thing I uh, do is uh, tie fly fishing flies. Didn't use too many this year. I didn't even go fishing. The Springfield uh, seemed to eat up all my time, so really didn't uh, have the urge to go out on the river and do any fishing this year. So, but I probably can still tie some flies. I got plenty of material. Maybe next year I uh, might get the urge to do a little bit of fishing anyway. One thing I might try to pick up this winter, I got some friends of mine that are big into ice fishing. So I might uh, see if I can tag along with those guys someday and, and uh, see what this ice fishing thing's all about. They talk about like it's a lot of fun, so. They have uh, little ice fishing tents with heaters and everything, so they, you know, they say they don't get cold standing out on the ice. So might have to try that out, see what, uh, see what that's all about. So anyway, that's a, uh, that's my thoughts for today. Not a, not a real big video. I gotta get back home before I uh, get too cold. Might be able to get out a couple more times this year, but I don't know. Another thing uh, I wanted to kind of inform you guys of is I've got uh, quite a few videos saved up from the summer, so I'll probably be putting those out throughout the winter to so we can dream about what it used to be like when it was nice and warm and everything instead of being all snowy cold out. Anyway, if you guys would uh, put your uh, hobbies down in the comments. I'm kind of curious what everybody else does. I might uh, pick up another cool hobby from you guys. So my wife probably wouldn't like that too much, but you know, we'll see what you guys do too. So if you would just go ahead and throw a, a comment or two in down there and uh, Hope you guys have a, a good day and ride safe and take care. Thanks for watching.